In Excel, there are a few ways to highlight highest and lowest values with conditional formatting. Highlight top or bottom n values using built-in rules. For example, highlight the top three scores. Select the range in which you had like to highlight numbers. On the Home tab in the Style group, click on Conditional Formatting. In the drop-down menu, select Top Bottom Rules and then click on Top 10 Items. In the dialog box, enter the number of items to highlight. Three here and choose one of the predefined formatting options. To apply formatting which is not in the list, click on Custom Format. In the Format Cells dialog window, choose the desired font, border and background color respectively. If you want more colors than the standard palette provides, click on More Colors button in the Fill tab. To apply a gradient background color, click on the Fill Effects button on the Fill tab and choose the desired options. Once you select the colors and pattern, click on OK. You will see a sample of the background. Click on OK. The changes made here are reflected in the selected range immediately. Click on OK to save and apply the format. Top three scores are highlighted. Highlight top or bottom n values by creating a new rule. For example, highlight bottom 25% scores. Select the range to highlight. On the Home tab, click on Conditional Formatting. Select New Rule. In the New Formatting Rule dialog box, select Format only top or bottom ranked values. In the drop down list, select bottom and type how many values to highlight in the box next to it. Enter 25. Check the percentage checkbox. Click on the Format button and select a format. The preview section shows the selected format. Once done, click on OK. The bottom 25% scores are highlighted using the selected format. Both the methods are easy to apply but have a significant drawback. To show a different number of values, you will have to edit the rule and change the number. For example, to highlight top 5, change 3 to 5 in the Edit Formatting rule window. Top 5 scores are highlighted. Highlight top or bottom n values using a formula. To make the rule more flexible, you can base it on a formula. Use large function to highlight top values and small function to highlight bottom values. For example, highlight top and bottom values using a formula based rule. First enter the number of values to highlight in an input cell. Enter the number of top values in G3 and the number of bottom values in G4. Select the range of numbers. On the Home tab, click on Conditional Formatting and select New Rule. In the New Formatting Rule dialog box, select Use a formula to determine which cells to format. In the Format values where this formula is true box, enter the formulas for top and bottom n values respectively. For top n values, enter this formula where $A, $2, colon $C, $14 is the applied range, A2 is the leftmost cell of the range and G3 is the n value. Use absolute reference for applied range and input cell and relative reference for the upper left cell. Click on the format button and choose the desired formatting. Click on OK twice. Top three values are highlighted. The large function returns the nth largest value in the specified range. In this case, it finds the third largest value. The formula compares each number in the selected range with the third highest value. For any cell that is greater than that value, it returns true and the conditional formatting rule is applied. For bottom n values, use this formula. Use the small function. Click on the format button and choose the desired formatting. Click on OK twice to close both windows. The top three and bottom five values are highlighted in different colors. Now to highlight top five values, type 5 in G3 and Excel will automatically apply the change. Highlight rows containing top or bottom n values. Sometimes we need to highlight entire rows that contain top or bottom n values in one column. Highlight the student's name and score of the top three students. Enter top and bottom values in F3 and F4. The rules must be applied to the whole table. Select all the columns. Use this formula to highlight top three rows. C2 is the topmost cell of the numeric column based on which the row is highlighted. 
dollar c dollar 2 colon dollar c dollar 14 are the numbers to be ranked f3 is the number of top rows to highlight select a format and click on ok click on ok top three rows are highlighted use this formula to highlight bottom five rows now the entire rows that contain top and bottom three scores are highlighted these rules are flexible to highlight bottom three scores change the value in f4 to 3 the change is reflected immediately and bottom three rows are highlighted highlight top or bottom n values in each row enter top and bottom values in j3 and j4 to highlight top n values in a row use this formula the formula is like the one used in the earlier examples except cells and range references change in excel conditional formatting references are relative to the upper left cell of the range the rule applies to in this example the rule is applied to all the numeric cells b2 to g14 but the formula is written for row 2 excel then virtually copies the formula to c2 d2 etc as the columns are locked with the dollar sign the range does not change when copied to other cells in the same row to highlight bottom n values in a row use this formula use the small function top and bottom two values are highlighted in a row to download practice excel file please click on the link in the description if you like this video please subscribe to our channel